So, not Dunbar Camping and Caravan Club, we're at Windermere. And here's two Muppets. Just sort of show them what it's like here as well. I think they're the ones that work here. Uh, so I don't go up. So let's go down here. And he's an happy chappy on his holidays. Zeus? Yeah, not interested in you lot. October, and you'll see how many people are still on here. It's a bit breezy. Still loads of people on here. We'll go walk up that way. Oh, I'll back and do that first. Yeah. I don't know if there's any. There is people in these, look. Yeah. I'm going to lock the car then. Just getting colder now. Cheers. The Muppet's here. And it's nearly peanut time. Mmm, having a arrow peanut taste test. And here's where we are at the minute. Silent all day. Like yeah. bike. Not many down this bit, is there? Well, it's rammed up the top for the time of year. And in the distance, I don't know what they are. And see them. And a tree. <laughs> and wine. And a donkey. And now. It's nearly pub and peanuts time. Rabbit time for this. Oh yeah. So dog keeps sniffing like mad because behind us here is a rabbit warren. And I like rabbits. Right, we're going down the pub. This is round the back of the campsite, you can cut through, but we thought we'd come the scary route. We might have to find some nice music to go to this. If the camera jiggles about, it's because I'm looking through the camera, not where I'm walking. There's uh, not a lot of people down here, is there, around this bit? That's quite scary. That's that film it reminds you of. Uh, Don't start with that. Um, oh, you know the one that was filmed on a video. Oh, I can't remember. Oh, that's going to do me out here now. It was all filmed on like a live camcorder. That was in the woods like this. When you heard the screaming and then one of them dropped in. Blair Witch. That's it. Yeah. Oh. Don't turn that off. Come on. Oh. Look where you're there. Yeah. Right, this is show you where we're going. I'm going to cut it here so I can see where I'm walking. Right, so, just come round the back there. You can cut through the site, as I say, but we've come round the back. This Muppet here has just had a WWF round with an hedgehog. 
The hedgehog Come. wasn't harmed, by the way. <laughs> no, the hedgehog curled up and he couldn't figure it out. And I don't know if it stuck him in the nose or what, but he didn't like it and was adamant he was going to have it. And here we are at the whistling pig, which is on the site. You can cut through, but it's nice to walk down there. Scary Blair Witch way. Yeah, that's what we're at the pub for. No, I mean him. No. Nope. No, nope. right, so we'll go around the back and get the drinks in. Whistling Pig Pub. You've already seen this, but this is what it's like in there. It's where you can have all your food. It's like they've even got a pool table in there. Doesn't look like it's very popular. Idiots round here. And Zeus. Oh, yeah. So, what are you laughing at? Him. Muppets down there. Jumping. I can smell it. <laughs> and he's over there, look. This is where we're going to be doing the test. <laughs> he's, <done another> one. <laughs> he's excited, or the hedgehog scared him less. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's a nice little outdoor beer garden area. <laughs> It'd be nice in the summer. Red hot sun beaming down on you when you have your drinks. And in there is where they have all the snap. Mmm, snap. And out here is where we're getting all the wind. Yeah, from that. It's not the weather. <laughs> and the dog's doing it as well. Hey! And here we are at the pub, the whistling pig. I don't know if they'll hear me all right because they're a bit away from the camera, but I'm not shouting because they're eating the dinner in there. Cheers. The lighting's not brilliant, there is lights out here, but it's pitch black when you're away from them. So, what we're testing, he's testing what's it, which he knows you like. First one we're going to do is, is it BM today? Yeah. Which we got from BM today. If he sounds a bit quiet, turn your volume up because the volume won't burn. Plane. And that just sounds like somebody's invading. This is the first one, if you can see it. Snazzy bottle, you even get an opener with it. Bottle opener. Keyring one. And it is chili flavoured peanuts. A true and honest snap. But they don't look like there's a lot of chili on them, does it? No, but I thought, do you know what, for three quid, they're nice little stocking fillers. It wasn't going to be these, it was just the habanero, but we thought we'd try this as well. I don't know if these have come out. <laughs> Such a gentleman. I've got my hands full. I do, I do. I need a couple. Don't smell a chilli. Nope. Mm. I thought they might yeah. Why? Just look at it. Now, you're getting these as a present. It's a snazzy present, but don't get them for anybody that's a chilly maniac like us. Because I can't taste any. No. And yeah, they are hard. Really hard. Mm, I don't like them. No. Not a lover. Dip with a beer on that one. We'll have to go into Zeus's bag. We'll have to leave them in the bottom. So. The next one. Mm. Oh, now these ones I've been looking forward to. Chilies. 
from Asda. I think they're a couple of quid. Habanero chili peanut. No, he's not having them. He's having his what's it. So we'll try these. Thank you, pardon. See if they are hot. They're better. Even the texture. Right. They're nice. nice. Real nice flavour. But I ain't getting any heat from it. It's like a smoky barbecue. Mm. If you want nice tasty peanuts, then yeah, because mm. they've got a real nice flavour. Better than dry roasted. But, oh. no. Mm. A bit disappointing. No heat at all to that, there's a bit in the back of my throat. The best thing out of that lot was the key ring. Mm. <laughs> No, no, no. Nice flavour, but they're not hot. Like you say, they taste like barbecue straight paprika. Mm. And that's it. Chili. You want nice, tasty peanuts? Get them. If you're looking for a chili kit, done. No, not there. I think we're going to have to make our own. We have to either make our own or get in touch with chili wizards who do reaper peanuts ah you can make your own reaper peanuts you did it before or you toasted them all yourself mm. that might be a recipe keep watching yeah we might try that one so that was a let down you want hot and spicy peanuts get something else <laughs> basically and don't get them ones but if you want any flavour, yeah, don't get them from being them. They haven't even got just, salt on them. Just rock hard peanuts, and that's it. With a slice of chilli in, mm. in the bottle. Good novelty. Um, if you want a nice tasty, there is a bit in the back of my throat, but it's not hard. I mean, if, if, you, if you're a mild curry fan and you want a chilli kick, then these will do. But if you're over a medium in a curry, you're going to be a saying... They're a nice taste, but where's the chilli? Mm. So, that's our opinion on that one. Yes, disappointing. So we're now going to go back to drinking. And we're back in tomorrow and see what uploads in the meantime. See you then. See you for now. Waste of two quid. Mm. I said it was a waste of two quid. Yours weren't three quid like mine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and you can't see him. Oh, <laughs> Hello, people. I'm having lots of <laughs> Once more. Bye for now. Right then. It's a doggy knockout. And didn't drop one of them. I was going to say he didn't drop one, but he's dropped a lot since we've been here, so <laughs> he didn't drop a what's it. <laughs>